What up, Long Beach? Welcome back to the562.org. It's Tyler, and this college baseball highlight is brought to you by the fine folks at Naples Rib Company, and all of the 562's Dirtbags coverage this season is sponsored by P2S. An impromptu series at Bull Diamond at Blair Field, Long Beach State, and number 15 Gonzaga, both escaping the snow in the Midwest. The only reason these teams are playing? Well, only the cold. Long Beach State looking to... Uh, get a marquee series win against the Zags on their home field under the flashing lights. And sophomore Jake Ron's gonna fill in for Friday starter Luis Ramirez, a late scratch with minor shoulder discomfort. So Ron's gets his first start of the year and he's greeted rudely with one on and one out. Steven Lund gets all of that one to left as the Zags gonna jump out to an early 2-0 lead. Yeah, they went to uh, go Lund me to fund that lead. His second bomb of the year, going to lose the glasses and then reapply, but uh, had no problem seeing that ball as Gonzaga's up 2-0 after one. Their ace, Gabriel Hughes, 6'4", 220, sophomore who gets up into the mid-90s, and uh, he showed his stuff. He has 30 Ks in 19 innings pitch this year, and uh, yeah, had the bags reaching a little late on the fastball, had three of his six strikeouts in the first two innings, scoreless frames as he uh, definitely came to play in the early going. Top four, Zags now leading three nothing, runners at the corners with no outs. Josh Haley now pitching. Haley's Comet has Sam Canton a little out in front for the first out, but this is a West Coast series. The Zags gonna use the squeeze from Connor Cabales to score Shea Kramer. It's now four nothing Gonzaga but Haley with a little PFP to end the rally. He inherited two on and no out, held the Bulldogs to just the one run. Nice job in relief to kind of keep things in range. Bottom four now, Rocco Pepe gonna line this one for a leadoff single. That was the first hit of the night for Long Beach State. Then Eddie Saldivar gonna slap it deep in the hole at short. Rocco's got enough Pepe in his steppy to beat the throw to second. Now two on, nobody out for the Dirtbags. First time Hughes has felt the pressure with the heart of the order coming up. But Hughes gonna bear down and get a huge K for the first out of the inning. But Tyler Porter gonna stroke a single into right center field. Pepe's gonna be held at third, so the bases are loaded with just one out. Up comes Chris Jimenez. He's gonna top one out in front of the mound. Zags looking for the one, two, three double play, but the throw to first is gonna get away. And here comes Saldivar. Fast Eddie gonna come around and score. Bags on the board with some good base running. It's now four to one in the fourth. Alex Pimentel looking for a two out RBI, gonna drive one into the gap, but Enzo Apodaca is gonna run it down in left center to end the inning. Two out rally now, bottom five. After a Chase Luttrell double, Pepe gonna work a walk to put two men on, but Hughes gets the K to strand the pair. He had six strikeouts. Top of the six, Gonzaga looking for more. First two men reach. This grounder could have been a double play ball. The throw is high, so now the bases are going to be loaded with nobody out. It's Gonzaga looking to kind of put this game away here in the middle innings. Canton grounds it to second. Another double play chance, but the throw to first is just a little late. So another run manufactured by Gonzaga. After another RBI fielder's choice, Xavier Pinales is going to single to right. That plates a third run. It's now 7-1 to one Zags in the sixth. But that's all they would get as Chris Jimenez is going to fire down to catch the runner. Great throw from the senior backstop there. Fast forward, bottom nine, Dirtbags with a two-out rally. Pinch hitter Peyton Schultz lines a base hit to center field. Isaac Ramirez going to move up to second base. Then Chase Luttrell keeps the line moving. His RBI single goes back up the middle. That was his second hit of the day. As Ramirez would score, it's now 7-2 Gonzaga. So Dirtbag still with life. You gotta get all the outs. Pepe gonna deliver his second hit of the night. That would load the bases here with two outs. Bags just trying to make things interesting, but the grounder to first will end it. And number 15 Gonzaga gonna win the opener in Long Beach, 7-2. The Dirtbags had some chances but they left 10 men on base. Gonzaga only left five in a five run win. Long Beach falls to five and seven on the year and will look to regroup game two on Saturday at 3 p.m. We wanna thank all of our sponsors, including Ocean Law Center for their support of local sports coverage. And if you wanna keep up with the dirt bags and all sports going on in the LBC, you gotta keep it locked right here at the 562.org.